Hi there. This is a set of videos that I put together just for you. I look forward to reading your comments and receiving your suggestions on how to make these videos more enjoyable or ideas for specific content that you might have. Thanks for watching. On Bring a Trailer today, three unsold all wheel drive 993s. An Aventurine Green over Black 1995 Porsche 911 C4 Cabriolet with 15,000 miles was bid to $81,993. A Black 1996 911 C4S with 84,000 miles was bid to $98,000. A Grand Prix White 43,000 mile 1994 911C4 wide body was bid to $175,000. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. Two Porsche 911 GT3s, a 996 and a 997. A Midnight Blue original owner 2004 911 GT3 with 20,000 miles sold for $141,000. A superb example. The interior is just too much natural brown. One commenter noted that the leather used is superior to others in 911s. This was well purchased. A Riviera Blue 14,000 mile 2011 911 GT3 sold for $278,993. The blue interior splotches are not to my taste, nor are the yellow belts. A stunning car, this was very well sold. The 997.2 is considered by some the pinnacle of 911 development. Porsche does their best every year to dismiss that thought. Still, a great car. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On Bring a Trailer today, a backdated 911. On PCAR Market, another take described as a resto mod. A tan, backdated 1989 Porsche 911 Coupe 3.6 liter sold for $133,000. Tan is not normally in my wheelhouse, but this car has been exceptionally well built. This was well purchased. A Dolphin Gray 1989 Porsche 911 C4 Coupe described as a resto mod sold for $136,250. Resto mod exteriors usually evoke a previous generation of 911. This one looks like a 964. It's a decent car though, and likely was a more than fair purchase. Which is the superior car? Both sound and seem to drive and handle well. I'd say it's a color choice. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On Bring a Trailer today, on the Italian side, a blue Dino 1972 Dino 246 GT with 52,000 miles sold for $514,246. A stunning example, this was, at half a million dollars, a fair price. This car was offered at Gooding Auction in August where it sold for $423,000 plus buyer's premium, but the sale fell through. The seller made a few more dollars for his trouble by offering it here. It is a lovely car. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On Picar Market, a pair of Guards Red 944s. A 1986 944 Turbo with 67,000 miles sold for $24,250. Very clean and with sport seats. Only 15,000 miles have been added in the past 20 years. This was well sold. A Guards Red Over Black One Owner 1991 944S2 Cabriolet with 72,000 miles sold for $9,100. Fitted with a snazzy bra, nice, S2s are non-turbo successors to the original 944s, utilizing larger engines and the body of the turbo. Cabs typically sell for less than coupes. This was well purchased. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On Bring a Trailer today, two black open top 997 Porsche 911s, a Cabriolet and a Targa. A basalt black over gray 49,000 mile 2008 911 Cabriolet sold for $37,750. A fair price. This is where I think 997s should be sold. Another black 997, this a 
12,000 mile 2007 911 Targa 4S presented by a great seller, sold for $86,001. A low mile car, yes, but a fat price on a fine car. This was very well sold. Is this 997 worth $50,000 more than the previous one? Not to me. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On Bring a Trailer and Cars and Bids today, Porsche Boxsters. A seal gray over gray 2001 Boxster with 87,000 miles sold for $10,250. A nice car with gray and black inside, this was well purchased. A lovely lapis blue over gray 2003 Boxster S with 50,000 miles sold for $17,000. I am not going to beat up the interior, but I do want to show this interior compared to our first Boxster. The steering wheel makes a difference. No, this was a fair sale. A speed yellow over black 2005 Boxster with 67,000 miles sold for $19,500. A clean Boxster in above average condition. This was a fair sale. Me? I'll take the seal gray and throw in some black floor mats. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On peak car market today, a black 1974 914 GT Tribute 3 liter sold for $105,000. A build executed at an extremely high caliber, this was well sold. Stripped of bare metal and built up from the ground with either new or restored parts, this is something special. Utilizing a 911 SC sourced engine that itself was completely rebuilt, the transmission was similarly rebuilt and the suspension and brakes were upgraded to mimic the 914.6 specs with 911 hardware in place. It's really a cool car. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. Four unsold cars on Bring a Trailer today, one on Cars and Bids. A Garnet Red 1986 Porsche 944 Turbo with 86,000 miles was bid to $18,000. A Triple Black 1988 911 Cabriolet with 109,000 kilometers located in Canada was bid to $41,000. A Conda Green over Black 1970 911E Targa was bid to $80,500. A Rosso Corsa Euro 1983 Ferrari 308 GTB Quattro Vivale 3.5 liter was bid to $90,000. On cars and bids, a midnight blue over Sand Beige 2007 Porsche 911 Targa 4S with 122,000 miles was bid to $35,250. That's a wrap for today. See you tomorrow. Here's a quick summary of the action on Bring a Trailer today. 1111. The black 2008 Cayenne GTS with 147,000 miles that sold for $20,957. A Guards Red 1974 911 Coupe sold for $63,000. A Carrera White 2009 911 C4S Coupe with 58,000 miles sold for $72,000. A Shark Blue over Bordeaux Red 2022 911 Targa 4S with 1,900 miles sold for $178,000. Red. For Ferrari, a Nero 1987 Testarossa with 25,000 miles sold for $142,000. Red. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. Hi there. Porsche sold on Bring a Trailer include a triple black 32,000 mile 1998 Boxster that sold for $12,800. A steal on a 986. This was well purchased. An Atlas Gray 30,000 mile 2005 911S Coupe sold for $43,000. A great color on a good car. This was a fair sale. A black 18,000 mile 2005 911 C4S sold for $53,500. At the upper end of the price spectrum for a 996 non-GT2 or 3 or turbo, this was slightly well sold. A ruby red 33 years own 1965 356C coupe sold for $129,500.
a better than average car, this was a fair sale. On Bring a Trailer today, a black 2018 911 GT3 with 14,000 miles sold for $158,000. Perhaps a lesson in 2023 market dynamics, this car sold here in June for $170,000, and I created a short video about it, linked below. At that time, it wore Pepita interior bits that I complained about. It was relisted in September and bid and unsold at $163,000. Subsequent to that listing, the Pepita bits were exchanged for Alcantara and carbon fiber, and the car was driven a total of 350 miles. Very expensive and still, I believe, well sold. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. Today, Porsches include two GT3s. Hi there. Porsches sold on Bring a Trailer include a chalk 2022 911 GT3 with 600 miles sold for $225,000. Sticker here was $181,000. This was well sold. On cars and bids, a white 2022 911 GT3 with 2,100 miles sold for $228,000. Stickered at $198,000. This was well sold. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On P car market today, a Guards Red 29,000 mile 1995 911 Speedster conversion sold for $230,000. Originally a 993 cab, this Speedster style body conversion used a mixture of genuine 964 Speedster and 993 turbo components. This was well sold. This conversion uses a shortened windscreen and double hump tonneau cover from the 964 Speedster, 993 Turbo S rear quarters with integrated air scoops, and a Carrera S split grille deck lid as well as 993 Turbo bumpers, rockers, and fenders. The car has been refinished in guards red and rides on 18-inch wheels with polished lips and gray painted centers. It's said to have been professionally built using knowledge and specs from the only two factory 993 Speedsters ever built. Uncommon? Original? Yep, and yep. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On PCAR Market, an orange 1969 911S ST Tribute 3.4 liter twin plug located in Belgium sold for $110,000. Sit back and relax and permit me to share with you the entire driving video. A bargain sale price all the way around, shipping, whatever, well purchased. Stripped to bare metal and fitted with wide fender flares along with a new RS style interior including full roll cage and bucket seats in black and pepita. The twin plug engine is stout, as evidenced by the video. The suspension's also been upgraded along with the brakes, and the car is said to have had a complete mechanical overhaul. The car weighs approximately 2,200 pounds, and the engine produces 328 horsepower. A ripper. And I like it. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. Hi there. Porsche sold on Bring a Trailer include a speed yellow over black 2004 911 C4S Cabriolet with 90,000 miles that sold for $33,500. A repainted maroon over black Rest of World 1977 Carrera 3.0 Targa with 97,000 miles sold for $43,500. A Bahia Red 1971 911E Targa presented by a great seller sold for $57,000. Another open car, an Ocean Blue over Gray 1997 911 Cabriolet with 48,000 miles presented by a great seller sold for $60,493. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On Bring a Trailer today, three Porsche Turbos, a 996, a 997, and a 930. An Arctic Silver 2002 911 Turbo Coupe X50 with 25,000 miles located in Canada sold for $70,000. This is a nice car. Sad, sorry, sea of ghostly, gloomy, gray, notwithstanding. 
and it was well sold. A Meteor Gray 36,000 mile 2007 911 Turbo Coupe sold for $90,200. This was a fair sale. A black, modified Rest of World 1983 911 Turbo with 69,000 miles sold for $103,000. Modified cars don't typically bring the dollars. This was perhaps well sold. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On Bring a Trailer today, a triple black Canadian market 1989 Porsche 911 Speedster with 3,000 kilometers sold for $238,000. One of 17 made for Canada, this was very well sold. Relocated to California in 2009, Speedsters are loved by many, loathed by some. Their lines defy the classic narrow body of the 3-2 coupes. They bulge here and are stripped down there, all the time looking more menacing to others, yet they are powered by the same engine as the plain old 911s. They carry the wider turbo bodywork, suspension and brakes, and their windshields are trimmed to a beautiful, minimalist design. These were imposing 911s in their day, and today. That's all for this day. See you tomorrow. On Bring a Trailer today, a yellow modified ST style 1970 911T Coupe twin plug 2.5 liter sold for $88,500. A lot of track car for the money with some deferred maintenance due. This was likely a bargain. The car was fitted with 911 ST style bodywork, including a fiberglass trunk lid, engine cover, front fenders, rear flares, and bumper covers. The replacement 2.5 liter magnesium engine wears twin plug heads and is fed by 46 millimeter Weber triple throat carburetors and it redlines at 8,000 RPM. With weight around 2,000 pounds and horsepower likely above 250, bun! That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On Bring a Trailer today, a pair of Ferrari 512s, a BBI, and a TR. A Rosso Corsa 27,000 kilometer Euro 1992 512 TR sold for $254,000. A nice car. Again, photography. The Rosso looks much deeper than typical. This was a fair sale. Let's compare the Rossos. Another, this on a 1984 512 BBI with 16,000 miles sold for $308,000. Originally delivered to Austria, it hit our shores just two months later. A beautiful car, this was likely a fair sale. The better car, the BBI. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On Bring a Trailer today, a Grand Prix White Rest of World 1982 911 Turbo roof modified with 83,000 kilometers sold for $157,000. Delivered to the German buyer and then forwarded to Roof, then sent to Japan where it remained until it was imported to the U.S. earlier this year. This was very well purchased. Modified by Roof to a displacement of 3.4 liters and mated to a 5-speed manual transaxle. Roof bumpers, modified suspension and brakes, wheels and exhaust, along with an oil cooler and Recaro front seats were also fitted. Sharp. Swift. Special. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. Porsche sold on Bring a Trailer include a triple black 1995 911 Cabriolet with 59,000 miles that sold for $64,000. Cabs are a great way to get into a 993. This was a fair sale. A Jiminy Blue 1973 911T Coupe located in Canada sold for $78,500. A very nice T, not a bargain, but certainly fair. A black 2018 911 GT3 Touring with 4,200 miles sold for $221,000. Sticker here was $148,000. This was fair based on comparable sales. For Ferrari, a Rosso Corsa over beige 38,000 mile 1994 348 Spider sold for $75,000.
not a bad car. This was a fair sale. On bring a trailer, a Dino that became a Ferrari, a 308 GT4, a red and black over beige 1978 Ferrari 308 GT4 with 6,000 miles presented by a great seller sold for $130,007. A special car, ones like this are very uncommon. This was another top of market example sold at a fair, justifiable price. Just to be clear, when introduced, these were Dino GT4s, and in 76, they changed to being Ferrari GT4s. That's all for today. See you tomorrow. On peak car market today, three Targas. A Guards Red Over Black 1985 Targa sold for $50,000. Supposedly meticulously maintained, yet full of notices from the independent inspection, to me, this screams run. Well sold and good luck to the buyer. A Grand Prix White over Black modified 1990 911 Targa 3.8 liter with 144,000 miles sold for $128,750. One of 158 produced for the model year. This car has been serviced and modified by Patrick Motorsports to the tune of more than $100,000. This was a fair sale. An Arena Red over Cashmere Beige, 48,000 mile, 1996 911 Targa, sold for $92,000. A better than average car with some spares and replacements that accompany the sale, which was fair. In this trio, the 964 is definitely the pick of the litter. That is all for today. On Peak Car Market, an Arctic Silver 2000 911 C4 Coupe with 90,000 miles, sold for $19,700. A bargain price on a fair car, well purchased. An Arctic Silver 2008 Cayman S with 68,000 miles sold for $28,000. Just beyond fair, well sold. An Arctic Silver 24,000 mile 2008 911 C4S Coupe sold for $52,000. With this mileage, this was a fair sale. That's a wrap for today. Thanks for watching. See you tomorrow. Be well. On Bring and Trailer today, a GT Silver over Ascot Brown 601 mile 2005 Porsche Carrera GT located in Canada sold for $1,781,420. Well, what do you say about one of the best cars in the world? Going on 20 years old and with 600 miles. Exceedingly sublime. One of 1,270 built, carbon fiber frame and body panels, 5.7 liter V10 producing 605 horsepower at 8,000 RPM and 435 pounds feet of torque at 5,750 RPM. Delivered to Illinois, then sunning in Florida, later sunning in the UK, and now in Canada. 60 seconds isn't enough. This was a fair sale. That's all for today. See you tomorrow.